Hi, yeah. Thank you for being part of all this. I hope you're finding this series on the uh, spirit of Jesus helpful. We've tried to look at the, his birth and God with us and uh, and in us uh, as a result of Pentecost. We've tried to look at the kingdom and the way that Jesus took the roles of the the role of as king of the kingdom with the uh, healing, good news, casting out of demons, justice and righteousness, and how the Pentecost expanded that and gave us those roles and uh, this week we're looking at the death of Jesus and the way that the in Christ Jesus the law of the spirit of life set us free from the law of sin and death beautiful verse from uh, Romans chapter 8 verses 1 and 2 and uh, it ties in really well I, I think anyway with the baptism uh, and so it seemed an appropriate talk to do at that point so anyway um, I like this idea of the law of sin and death that that sin kills us and and I think as I meditate on that and think about that the way that um, we are diminished by sin the way that sin wrecks people's lives the way that sin ruins our lives and our soul and and puts us and our relationships uh, really at death's door and the deeper magic as C.S. Lewis talks about is that the law of the spirit of life uh, that because of the cross, because Jesus has accepted all of that into himself, all of that sin and hate and hurt into himself, uh, that that's released the law of the spirit of life. And we can live in the 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 benefit of that death. And Romans 8 is just another a, a long list of the benefits and outworking of the benefits of being in Christ Jesus. I'd encourage you to uh, read Romans 8 a couple of times tonight and and allow the Lord to speak to you through that um, but there's all sorts of stuff there isn't there about hope there's all sorts of stuff there about freedom there, there's stuff there about the way that we change our mind there's the way that we know the love of God the way that we're adopted into his family and uh, all sorts of opportunity to rejoice in the fact that nothing will separate us from the love of God such a fantastic chapter have a great time as you look at it read it pray over it and seek to imbibe it and activate it in your life over these uh, next weeks. See you in a bit. Have a good time. Bye-bye.